no, no, wait, wait, wait. Are you denying that? Denying what? That Muhammad had this black slave? I'm not denying anything. I don't want you to prove it to me. If you're not denying it, that basically means that you're my side, brother. He came and he said, and you only have to abolish slavery. That's one of the things he said. That's a fact. But then it doesn't necessarily mean that he's an abolitionist in Islam. He himself kept slaves. He abolished bacon. He didn't abolish slavery. No, I want to know though. Okay, but anyway, let's see. Hold on, is that, is that something new that you've learned today? I got it, I got it. That Muhammad had slaves. That Muhammad had slaves. Black slaves. Is it something new that I've learned? Yeah. I didn't know that he had slaves. And that he deals with slavery and slavery was legit. So now how do you deal with it? How does that impact you? Like, what does that mean to you? In terms of morality and ethics. If he had slaves and he dealt with slavery and he was open to do it, then obviously it's wrong. A hundred percent. But I'd like obviously to see how he done that. Look, I and love the brothers here who are just straight honest. You know what I'm saying? I love I don't, I don't you know, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I don't know everything, but at the same time, if I can prove to you mm. that he did have slaves, yeah. and, or he freed slaves, shall I say, yeah. or that slavery was wrong, mm. or we encourage as Muslims to free slaves, mm -hmm. then, then what would that say to you? Yeah, yeah, that's true, that's true. And then what would your views on Muhammad be after that? Indeed, hundred percent. And then what would you think? Would you think he's a better person than how you see now? That's a good conversation. Um, I don't know. I don't know who wants to have that conversation. I'm just trying to be like out of the conversation. He's got that nice smelling stuff like right now. No one. Somebody's smelling sweet. Who's smelling sweet? It's you. Oh, I'll tell you. I need some of that. Go, on, bro. Oh, God, you lot had your conversation, man. I'm glad to help. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Pull my eye out. Hey, this is just um, kind of like the, the most notable of Muhammad's slaves. More notable, uh, Safiya bin, can I pronounce that name? <laughs> Mary, given to Muhammad by his official whom he freed, who may have become his whom he freed, and who may have become his wife. Okay. So he freed her to become his wife. Okay. Do you know the rights he, she gets as a wife? But he, she was a slave, and he freed her, and then he become, married to her to become a wife. Okay. And you so think he that's a bad thing. He, he, didn't, he didn't free her to go. He freed her so that she become his wife. But you know, in Islam, you can't marry someone that doesn't want to marry you. You can't marry someone that doesn't want to marry you. So, I'm simply saying that today you kind of like really understood that Muhammad did have... So he had a slave, More than freed no, no, a slave, no, you, no, and no, no, he married her, and not just, that's the wrong thing. Hold on, you're using this one example. I'm just using the example you brought to me, but bro. But there are other examples of Muhammad, and the guy, so Kalam showed you. Example. But he showed you the hadith. Okay, show me another one. But how many do you want to how many do you want to see before you can you yourself said that this is wrong? There is no attack here. So you show me one, the one that you show me now, someone gave him a slave and he freed them, which you said that he didn't do before. But that was just Okay, but no no but this free. Come on, let's just agree with what you said before. You said that he had slaves and he traded in them. So you've just shown me something that he's freed them and he's married her. And what I'm saying to you, do you know yeah. the rights of the wife? He said no. The woman will have a lot of rights as her being a wife now. Yeah? So how is that wrong? How is that a bad thing? Is she free to just bounce up and go where she wants to? What do you mean as a wife? Would you let your wife bounce up and do what she wants? Well, let me ask you something, yeah? yeah. If you're a slave, yeah. do you have freedom to go? No. Why not? Because you're a slave. Because you're a slave? Yeah. So I'm asking you, this woman, did she have the right to just go where she wants to go? When she was freed, yeah. How do you know? She's free. She's free. But no, she's his wife. But she freed him. She's only free. No, no, listen, let me, let, me, let me explain it again. She's only freed by freed her. virtue. He freed her first of all, yeah? And after that, he married her. Yeah. So in Islam, you can't marry someone that doesn't so, want to marry you. So, so why, she could have said didn't no. He just, why did so he have to said no, If she said no, she would have been a free woman, right? Why did he have to marry her? Why did he just say go? He didn't have to. So why he did he do? Why not? But that's the point I'm trying to make to you, What's right? What's the point? That slavery is something which Muhammad has black slaves. Okay. He owned black slaves. You know this is wrong. I know this is wrong. Everybody knows this is wrong. So this is wrong. I don't know. If there's any true word about anybody having slaves and black slaves, 
it is that. Go to your hadiths, go to your Quran and show investigate. It, show it. No, no, no. Go and first find out. Okay, it's all right. Like there's too much work. It's that, like you're, you're, that. It's like you're it basically saying that you don't want to believe that Muhammad has slaves. It is and I'll believe it. If you believe it. But he's the one you just see. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That, that, he's shown you. He's shown you on Sunnah.com. That Muhammad is saying. I don't know Sunnah.com. But he's showing you the Hadith. I don't know that Hadith. You need to know the context. You need to know the context. No, no, no. You need to know the context. 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 You need to know the Okay, maybe, but so at least why you, you know the reason. In the past, you're the one, you're the one that's telling me. Yes, because in the past I've studied and researched it, and I'm saying to you, to show me something. But we did already. So show me another one, because the one you just showed me. You have a reason. Why are you going to be the one to say I'm married her? So how can you take? How can you make me seem like I'm in the wrong when you've shown me? Because you're because the problem that's this. This is factual. You've been shown already. Jacko, so you don't want to show me no more. No, wait. The one that I showed you, are you denying that? The one you just showed me now. No, the one that was shown. To you on sunnah.com. Yeah, right. no, no, wait, wait, wait. Are you denying that? Denying what? That Muhammad had this black slave. I'm not denying anything. I don't want you to prove no, it to me. If you're not denying it, that basically means that you're my side, brother. Oh. Muhammad had black slaves. No, no, People no, of Melodin, we own us. Someone told me and someone got run over on the Oxford Street. And I say, I don't know. But we're not dealing with that conjecture. We're not dealing with that. We're dealing with somebody who showed you the Hadith that Muhammad had slaves. But he showed you. What's your point? What's your point? What's your point? Why can't you show me now? What's okay. your point? The point is that Muhammad had slaves. What's your point after that? Muhammad had slaves. That's a big enough point that's in itself. So what is prophecy? In itself, yeah. In itself, that's a that's a would you would you have slaves? I don't want to be in the video. Would, would any would anybody here have slaves? Behind slave. Would any of you have a slave? No, I would have a slave. Why not? I would have a slave because it's wrong to have slaves. It's wrong to. Yeah. But did Muhammad have slaves? At the time. He so then is Muhammad down, wrong logically? No, no, he's not wrong. You people don't want it. It's like it, what if, so the, the, the you, problem no, no, is here. No, the problem is here. Bro, right? no, you, you do have to go back to the context. Yeah. He doesn't know the time. He doesn't know history. It's at the time of, of history where he came about. There was slavery around. Yeah. All around the world. Is that true or false? You tell me, brother. You tell me. I'm listening to you. You know the context. So it's true. You know history. Around the world, or slavery, yeah. Black, black slaves, white people were slaves everywhere in history. Yeah, but none of them was not yeah. the example okay, to mankind. Finish. Let me finish what I'm saying. Come on, so man. he's come at a time where slavery was legal. He came and he said, and you only have to abolish slavery. That's one of the things he said. That's a fact. So you're saying to me, can you show me where he said that's abolish slavery? So many hadiths that talk about freeing slaves, and rewards. You don't want to pick those ones. I don't mind, man. We can be objective. I want to see where he says free slaves. Okay. But I also okay. want you to okay. accept so, so so the fact that now, wait, wait, wait. Let's say, stay on the topic. So now, give me one minute to Google if Muhammad freed slaves, yeah? Or to say abolish slavery. That's what you're going to find out. How do you talk with people that, that know about this? That able to discuss this more? Listen, Okay. Let's just go to the BBC website. See what saying, yeah? BBC? Okay, you don't want me to go to BBC? No, 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 it's up to you, man. This, this is your evidence. I won't go to BBC. Okay, I want these BBC. Compare the two. Compare the two. No, 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 you're, you're running away. You know what I'm He's basically saying that Muhammad was a bad guy because no. he traded. Okay, he said Muhammad had slaves and he traded in them and he didn't free them. No, I'm asking you about. You didn't ask me. You was telling me. Do you have slaves? We, we, the question you we, we, we established the fact that you don't have slaves, right? But you know, you know, you know, slave, there's not slavery right now, bro. There's there no slavery in Libya. There's I'm slavery in Sudan. I can't have a slave. Yo, that's gangs. That's not excuse me, bro. Is there slavery existing bro, 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 in the world right now? Because whenever you say something and I try to, bro, you're telling me to look for something to show. You just said there is. You just said that there is no slavery. I'm telling you, there is slavery right now. I can't have a slave. Whether I want one or not. You just asked me, do I want to have a slave? No, no, I said, I said, do you? Have Bro, slaves. let me just finish finding what you said about having Muhammad in the. Muhammad you guys kind of like you go all over the place, man. Bro, I think you're losing your plot, bro. Just chill, chill out.
What are you looking for, Brother H? I'm looking for the hadiths, the outline that Muhammad had put in the slaves. Okay. And some of them mentioned the names. Oh, okay. Jacob. 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 The reason for slavery is kufr. Yeah? Yeah. Which means disbelief. So if you if you do a slavery, you're a disbeliever. You can't be anyone's slave, really and truly. There's only one Allah, one master. We're all slaves to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So for you to have slaves, okay, look, look at this now. Quran, yeah? Chapter 6, verse 115. Yes, it is good for the master to free the slave if he becomes Muslim. The lawgiver enjoined the courage that open many doors to it. Yeah, but you're showing Muhammad free slaves, right? What if he doesn't become Muslim? What if the slave doesn't become Muslim? Is it good to keep a slave there? Why not? Why would it be good? No, but because in Islam, slavery is permitted. And it's saying free him if he's a Muslim. Or if it's a woman and you get her pregnant, I believe, you're also supposed to marry her? No, you don't have to. And I think you do. I think the law is if you get impregnate your slave woman, you can marry her. Okay, I don't, I don't know. okay and if that, if that is true, is that a good or bad thing? I, I don't think it's a. I think slavery is a bad thing. No, but if you get your slave, just say. I, just I say. don't think you should be able to have relations with a slave because they have no consent. That would be considered rape in my eyes. Yeah. But if, if just say for example he does get a pregnant, I, I don't and he think marries her. That's like saying if someone murders somebody but he gives money to the family, is that a good thing? I would say no, murdering someone is wrong, whether you give money to the family or not. I'm saying you shouldn't murder someone to begin with. You shouldn't get a slave pregnant because you shouldn't have a slave to begin with. So why did Abraham have a slave and get so a I, I, so I th so First and foremost, ever. Well, answer the question. No, no, no. Why did, can I answer um, Yeah, okay. So my question is, I think slavery is wrong, whether it's in Judaism, whether so, it's in Christianity, whether it's in Islam. So Abraham was wrong to have that. So first of all, it's Abraham ever. Was, it's, it's was he not wrong? Slave. It's not slave. Was he wrong? It's not can slave. I read some stuff? He, he didn't have a slave, he had yeah. a servant. Yeah. Um, oh come on! You couldn't answer the question. Do you speak Hebrew? You couldn't answer the question. I just answered it. I asked you a simple question. And I gave you a simple. So this no, is, you didn't. Uh, this is, you you changed the word. This is Surah no, chapter thirty-four. You changed the word. And this is how the Quran justifies slavery. You changed the word in Hebrew. You changed the word in Hebrew. Prophet, we have made lawful to you the wives to whom you have granted dowries, and the slave girls whom God has given you as booty. That's Surah 3350. So the slave girls, so this is okay. Islam justifying yeah. slavery because the slave girls are now seen as booty. Okay, so where it was, if there's war, if there's a war, if there's a war and they don't kill the children or kill the women, then what are they meant to do with them? You don't keep them slaves. You let, the, you let them decide what they want to do. If they want to join your people, then let them join your people. But you don't capture them as slaves. Imagine, imagine we went into Iraq today. Imagine if the Americans went into Iraq today, and slaughtered slaves. the men, like and then took the years ago. And like they did 20 years ago. Yes, they did go in, but yeah, then exactly. they took out the women well, they and took out the slaves. Slave. They? Well, slavery is wrong in any generation. In the time of Abraham, in the time of Moses, time, time of, of David, Muhammad, time of David, and today, he did exactly slavery is wrong. Time yeah, of yeah, Solomon, yeah, he did exactly the same. Anybody who owns slavery is wrong. Slavery is wrong. Right? Is wrong. And any slavery you, is wrong. By your own admission, you said that you never, uh, you never. This, this is something new for you. And what is new for me? Like Muhammad having slaves. Yeah. By your own admission, no, you no, said no, no, no. What was new for me yeah. is you're saying to me that he had slaves and he traded his slaves. He says yes. and he didn't free them. That was new to me. Okay, so. I knew, yeah. there's a deeds that I've seen previously, whether I find them or not, that stated that you're meant to free slaves and there's rewarding free slaves. So you knew Muhammad had slaves? So for example, Bilal, 
his one of his companions was a slave, and he freed the slave and was one of his closest companions. But you knew so that why Muhammad would he do had that? So why would he do that? If slavery was something that he was doing for profit. Okay, so it wasn't new to you that Muhammad had slaves. You knew that Muhammad had black slaves and had slaves. Slaves is what? Slaves that he's not free no, to just nah, simply. It was new to me. I didn't know from Muhammad to have slaves. That was new to me. For Muhammad to have slaves, especially, and what I'm saying is, if he had slaves, he couldn't pay for the own ransom. Yeah, that were not allowed to marry, that didn't have no right to get free, that were treated as slaves as the Atlantic slaves. Yeah. And I'd like you to show me that. Yeah, because so I never knew that. I've got some Bahari, and I wouldn't Bahari expect him. I wouldn't expect him if he's a prophet to do so. 100%. That's right. That's right. That's right. Show you, show you made it. So this is Buhari, right? And Buhari, this is uh, volume 7, 137, and it's narrated by Abu Kuduri. Is that familiar to you? No, okay, I'll read it anyway. It's not. We've got female... Let me see, let me see. It's Buhari, and it's volume 7, 137. We've got, female cap we've got female captives in the war booty, and we used to do coitus interruptus with them. So we asked Allah's messengers, Allah's messenger about it and he said, do you really do that? Repeating the question thrice, there is no soul that is destined to exist but will come into existence to the day of resurrection. In other words, Muhammad here, the Muslims had taken slaves, right? And they were having sex with them. And Muhammad was now approving of this. And saying he was now approving of this, this is that right? you pull out so you don't impregnate the woman. That was the question. Is if we're having relations, do we have to pull out? But he was saying to them, I don't approve of this pulling out. So you can have the sex, but when you're about to, don't pull out. That's because if you're going to have a baby, you're right. going to have a baby because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But the man is still saying that they're slaves. Okay, that's number one. This is uh, volume 3, verse 6, six five. Never, by the same narrator, right? The free slave of Ibn Abbas. Free slave, yeah. Yeah, yeah the free slave of Ibn Abbas. Okay. That Miyama bint a conference told him that she had manumuted a slave girl without taking the permission of the Prophet. On the day when it was. You read this one. On the day when it was. Her turn to be with the prophet, he said, Have you really? She replied in the affirmative, You would have got more reward if you have given her, the slave girl, to one of your maternal uncles. In other words, in other words, he was a freed slave woman, but Muhammad is saying that she would have got more of a heavenly reward if this slave had been given to one of her uncles. So, in other words, she wasn't allowed to go free. This Bahari. is a uh, that, That's all over. Volume that hadith, is, that hadith appears everywhere. It's so like, sorry. Say that again. So basically, volume. she gave she gave a slave to someone else. And a woman, a, many, a, many, a many woman many. frees a slave, right? Yeah. Yeah. The, baby, baby. the woman so goes to Muhammad. The, the woman frees the slave. So they did free slave. They did free slave. The woman did yes. So so Muslims did free slave. I don't know. Yeah, Muslims, Muslims definitely free no, slave. because we initially started with him saying Muhammad did free It's what you're saying. If if your slave converts to Islam. Then it's a big. I don't know. We, I don't know what the word is in Arabic. But it's a, it's a big if, thing to set them free. Don't. If they don't, then you can keep them. There's another hadith that talks and about what, don't beat your wife like you'd beat your slave. So, so when you There's, keep them as a slave, what, what rights did the slaves have? So this, Muhammad, <laughs> well, they can't. Work. Can they go so, home? So here, here, no, no, I'm, so, no, asked, no, I'm no, just asking. That's, that's the to answer your question. Right, one of the greatest, one of the greatest things that we would say in today's modern society is that if you're having relations with a woman, they have to consent. One of the big things that a woman, to my understanding, and I'm not Muslim, so you probably know more than me, or certainly the brothers here will know more than me. The woman has no consent as to whether she has or doesn't have relations with her master. So that for me is a problematic statement. There's things in Judaism that are problem, Jewish. There are things in Judaism that are problematic as well for me. And so I think this it's is um, intellectually consistent. So there are, there are rights in Islam that a slave doesn't have. One of them is the right to say no so to her master. That's, oh, that's right, they don't have. They so, don't, what, they, so, so what rights do you the slaves have under, under Muslim rules? So you, you, you'd be a much better posed to answer that question being of the Dean of Islam than really? a Jew, and I don't know what this is.
one here is Christian. So what, what right do you believe that slaves have in Islam? I don't know. They, do, they don't have the right to go free. They don't have the right to say no to their master. They're two things so I know that do they, they have the right to get married? But no. So uh, they can marry amongst each other. And I believe... So you if do the know quite a bit then? Uh, if the master impregnates the, the slave girl, I think, and I could be wrong and I'll get corrected in the YouTube comments, I think he has to marry her. I, I think I uh, certainly marriage just thing to marry her if he gets her pregnant. But I'm not sure of that and the YouTube comments will correct me if I'm wrong there. Um, so, they, so they have certain rights? Uh, yeah, Islam isn't this like demonic thing that everybody says it is, but I'm saying in today's society, today's society slavery is wrong. We both agree that slavery is wrong. So do and you I think Muhammad believes slavery is wrong? I believe that Muhammad, from his teachings, he believed that setting free his slaves free in certain situations was a good thing. In other situations, he clearly didn't. He just never. He gave a hadith where he said it would have been better rather than freeing this slave girl to give it to the uncles. We also know he traded in slaves. Yeah. So certainly there was a progressive nature to setting some slaves free, particularly if they converted to the Deen of Islam. But in other situations, so, it would so appear that generally speaking, he was trying to free slaves. More no, I would say he was trying to free some slaves. But I would say if you look at the time where Muhammad that was a completely normal thing to do. But I'm saying by today's standards, it's not normal. So, so you don't think he came to abolish slavery? No, I don't think not he came to abolish Because if he came to abolish slavery, there would be an explicit um, explicit line in the Quran which doesn't talk about that which your right hand possesses. It talks about all slavery is wrong and set all free just, slaves free. There is so much here regarding Muhammad and Islam and slavery. I don't even know where to begin, bro. Honestly, this, it's just like a long page cataloging all kinds of slaves and it's giving you names it's giving you details of the particular names of that of that slave male female who was owned who was and i'm simply saying to you that muhammad owned slaves black slaves now i'm saying to you you don't own slaves you know that's right or that's wrong so i'm telling you that your conscience your morality your ethics is higher than muhammad's but you won't own slaves, but he yeah. did. So how do you explain yeah. that? Yeah. As I said to you before, for me, I'm not knowledgeable on this subject. However, That's what I do want. know... There's a man needs to be knowledgeable to know if they should have slaves or not. I never said that, though. But if you listen to what I'm saying, yeah, you'll get my point of view. What I'm saying to you, I don't know everything about this subject at all. Yeah? I've got no problem with that. You may be teaching me something new, which is brilliant. I have to go home and do research. However, what, I do, know, in a new what I do know, however, is at the time where he came, slavery was common around the whole world. Yeah, I agree with you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Course, yeah. I agree with you. So as you said about common society, it's only been the past couple of hundred years that slavery has been abolished now. Do you agree? Yes. By yeah. Christians. By Christians, yeah. By Christians, they were doing it themselves, okay. though, weren't so, they? So, yeah, but right. that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. matter. That doesn't matter. However, I'm just trying to think logically, as you said, yeah? As I said, I don't know much about the subject. If he came at a time when slavery was right, everyone had slaves. And from the one or two little things I've seen about slavery that come across, it says that there's benefit and reward for free slaves. When they ended it, he's trying to use At the same time, I understand. You can't completely stop a whole system of slavery overnight like that. It's not going to happen. So there may be there may be truth in what you're saying. I can't say that you're wrong. There may be truth that he traded. There may be truth that some got freed, some didn't. I don't know the context. However, I honestly don't believe I'm going to go home and Google it and see him saying, do you know what, Muslims, what we should do, we should slave our Jewish brothers, we should slave our Christian brothers, but we don't give them no rights. I am not want slave Jewish. So at the Battle of Faybar, when they took the, the, when they headed the Jewish men, they took the females captive, and they were then shared amongst the, the, the people who went to battle. Some of them were sold, some of them were kept. I think, was it Sophia even that came from Yeah, he married her, yeah. Yeah, and so that's an instance. I mean, and I don't want to get, I, actually, I think you're one of the most sincere Muslims I've spoken to here. And what I would say is, you're like me, you pick a value, and you, you stick to that value. And we've all said, you find slavery in Judaism. It's in the Torah, as this gentleman was so then, saying. So then why would you follow Judaism? So I follow Judaism because I think if you look like Islam, there are things in Islam which I find... So, so just to I get it straight, sorry to cut you off, but there's slavery in all of our religions. Yes. So we're all on the same table. So I all understand, understand. The, but the difference... Hold on, hold on, on. But the distinction is, for me, the very person who I use as an example Jesus Christ, he never owned slaves, he never had slaves, but there was he, okay, hold so on, hold on, hold on, he never ever, ever 
proclaim that Christians should go out and make slaves of other about people. About killing innocent the children. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. The problem that I have with Muhammad is that Muhammad is the measuring stick of all Muslims. You take your ethics and your morality from Muhammad. This is why today Islam is justified in particular countries in the Middle East, in Africa, in Sudan, in Libya. Right? They don't see it's wrong because he practices it. That's so, 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 so you follow Christ, yeah? Correct. As the command of evil. So what do you have in the Bible? At the time when Christ was talking about people, funny. There was slavery going on. Back in the yeah. most likely. Yeah. Okay. By the Romans. And so was there a law to say that slavery is wrong? By the Romans? I doubt no, it. No, no, by Jesus. He's saying the Jesus. I'm just saying the commandments, whatever Jesus followed as a Jew, were there, was there a law to say that slavery was wrong? Jesus didn't specifically speak on the subject. I think because primarily, this is my, my understanding, primarily because he was in a in a geographical place called Israel, right? And geographically Israel is very small. It was occupied by the Romans. They themselves were in bondage, right? And so he didn't he didn't actually go out and advocate slavery. Everything he spoke about, right, was regarding how people, how men should react to other men, right? And some something about your personality would shine through, and they would say, you know what? So do you Make agree this with that? Yes, absolutely. So if he was a slave, you wouldn't fight for freedom. Well, how would you against your own? Because that's what you just said. You just said. So what you'll do is you'll be the best slave to show your slave master and hope that he says, you know what? No, 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 Every certain set of years, you're supposed to set your free slaves the free. Yeah, the Jew, you set your slaves free. So that same concept of manumission that you find in Islam is also found in Judaism. Yeah, but there is the concept that the slave can say no, they want to remain a slave. And because if you do that, like in Islam, you're saying there are benefits to being a slave in the sense that you have. I wouldn't say there's benefits, but I was just wondering if they have rights. But have rights they have. I think if you step away, I think one of the most helpful things you can do as an intelligent person in these debates is. Step away from the scripture. Step away from the 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 because we're, we're all we follow our religions, and sometimes it blinds us. And we step away objectively, and we say, if I wasn't a Muslim or I wasn't a Jew, and I read in black and white text that it says here that slavery is okay, like if the Americans went to Iraq, killed the men, and then took the women slaves, would I agree with that? No, I wouldn't. And it's a, you wouldn't either. And so then, it's what do we do within the frames of our religion? Then can we still be a practicing Jew or a practicing? Muslim and find something that was practiced 1500 years ago or 3500 years ago problematic and can we find a source within our religion to actually justify our opposition to what's actually battle by. So I think there's many Muslims today who use Islam to say that slavery is wrong even though in the text black and white it says it's permitted but as you said there's a theme to treat your slave well to marry them in certain circumstances to set them free and so you can use that All as the foundation. in regards to slavery recently seeing that there was something to do with three things you can do that's the best you can do and one of them was to free slavery so my whole thing is with all this information you're coming with all this information you're coming with why would he say that you should free slaves if the benefit is for him to make money or whatever it is that he's trying to do i think, I think that the, the, the real poignant question here is what he said before it's if slavery is wrong, it shouldn't just be that it's meritous to set the slave free. It should be. Could you just finish? He said, the Quran says that you can't eat bacon. That seems trivial to me compared to keeping a slave. Slavery seems worse than bacon. And so you think there should be a black and white line that says that slavery is wrong. Yeah, but it's the same thing and I have the alcohol. same problem. But it's the same thing with alcohol. Alcohol is, is, is wrong in Islam. Yeah? Yeah. At the time, people drank alcohol. And when he first came about, from what I know, some brothers have been through. Four stages, yeah. Stages. There were slow stages. There were different stages to slowly getting rid of alcohol. Aggregation. Yeah? It wasn't overnight like that. And what I'm trying to say, just as you said, logically, isn't that as you said logically speaking, yeah. or logically thinking, if slavery was a massive thing that was going on around the world, all I'm saying is I don't think it will be over. It will be, it will be abolished overnight like that, just because he said it. So he may say free slaves, as I, as I believe he said, but there may be still to do with trading or marrying slaves or this and the other. So I help the same. So what are you saying that somehow yeah. that slavery can be justified? 
No, he's not. He's saying he's saying slavery should be abolished. Obviously, yeah. abolished. Yeah. And I'm saying I expect through the works of Muhammad. I, I, I see I that expect, he's working to that. Muhammad peace be upon him. Would not say that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Yeah. Because you're saying that slavery should be abolished. Ye
Muhammad, Islam isn't this barbaric hey, religion that goes around enslaving the world. What we're saying okay, is, okay. I'm, I'm not. That's how it no, 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 no. I'm being really, really clear. I'm saying, in a time of war, according to Islam, you can capture slaves, yeah, from, from the people that you're fighting. And I'm saying that Islam has expanded its borders with force all the way to Spain and Europe. Like they were fighting in Europe. So when they left Spain, when they got when they got beaten in war, whatever, did the Jews not leave with them? Um, no, so the Jews left in the Inquisitions. Um, they were, Did they not go with them to Morocco or something? So it's kind of conflate history. The, the Moroccans let the Jews in. It's not when they left, it's when they left, the Christians that were left over progressively put in very, very harsh laws for the Jews and eventually basically expelled them or forced them to convert to Christianity. To and then they fled to Morocco, they fled and, to Turkey. And the Muslims they fled to Morocco. were called the Jews. Muslims Morocco, and Jews yeah. have very good relations for most of our history. Okay. Like, because people tend to look at things in black and white. They, like, either Islam's really evil or it's really yeah, good. No, 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 it's but it's not. just because how the conversation started and I got wrote to be in the yeah. YouTube and all that is because he made it sound to me as if Muhammad was saying, slave everyone. He, no, didn't, he, he didn't free he slaves. Didn't say, he said he didn't, he didn't say free that. slaves. He said that he traded them this time and other. He slave, He freed yeah, slaves. I know, I know. But what I'm trying to say is, it may not be as black and white as you originally yeah, stated. But the because fact you made is, it initially the, sound. The, the no, no, only wait. black and white thing but anyway, is, there, there is one black and white line which we draw in the sand and which we all disagree with is slavery. Is slavery wrong? Yes, we all agree. I've got to go home and have my dinner. Aki, it's been fantastic talking. Just like a lot of Honestly, thank you very much. Thank you very much.